Hey guys, got a haircut. It's 2019. 2018 was a good year, I guess. So, so year. It, it varies. I mean, back at Litchfield won their first game in over five years. That's that's actually pretty good. That's actually good. You know? I... I honestly don't know what I'm thinking of 2019. I know I'm going to be turning 18 this year, and I don't know what I'm going to be doing. I'm working on my album. I'm trying to get that out for you guys. I'm working on all these songs, and I haven't had time to update you guys on YouTube. I'm sorry, I haven't. It's so exhausting. Yeah. I need mic to record with, so I mean they they'll have better quality. Honestly, I don't know what you want me to do or what you expect from me this year. But, uh, I'll try my best. I'm at 200 subscribers. That did not change at all this year. I found out. Try yeah. looking at my fish. It looked weird for a sec. Um, I think we can do better this year. So, I'm going to try and... I'm setting up a subscriber goal this year for a thousand subscribers at least. If I can get that, I'd be very happy. If we get 500, I'd be very happy to. Anywhere from 500 to 1,000. That's my subscriber goal for this year. So I'm going to try and succeed in it. I want to do it with you guys. Honestly, the fact that I'm even getting an album released is awesome. And you can hear my voice is still very scratchy. <laughs> I I honestly don't know what to say. You know, people look at me and. I don't know what they see with me. But now that I'm turning 18, I think it's... Well, gonna be turning 18. I think it's about time I said something that was on my mind. Every... I... I guess... It would be every time I try to make a new friend, it fails. Except for when I talk to you guys. You guys are one fourth of my world. Another fourth is my family. And another fourth would probably be my personal life. And then I got that one fourth open for whatever comes in the future. Um, I honestly don't know what will be coming for me in the future. <laughs> Who knows? <laughs> so, I actually want to experience this past path with you guys. I want to include you on my 2019, 2020, 2021, 2022, all the way to when I die. I want to include you guys. Well, not really till I die. I plan on retiring sometime soon from YouTube. I mean, it's a good hobby, you gotta admit. Like rapping. But honestly, I don't think I'll ever truly get the dream I wanted. In fact, it's funny how people say 
when you can grow up you can do anything you can do whatever you want when you grow up but yet it turns out most of the times we can't nobody ever mentions the struggles you're gonna go through in life in fact this is my 2019 to 2001 rewind here nobody's gonna mention the struggles you go through it, it'd be nice if they did because I would love to know the struggles ahead of time so I could prepare myself but what they don't mention is if you even get a heads up about the struggles they change all these struggles end up changing into something else and then they change again and they just change every year it sucks I get it you gotta push through <laughs> and sometimes you need a mother to ride on your ass to get through it but damn I love her I do love my mother <laughs> even though I don't say it to her face half the time I love her She's there for me when nobody is, and that's what a mother should do. In fact, I'm glad my mother was there, is there for me now even. And people are wondering what you should do after you turn 18, what job do you want to do? I don't know. Everybody says you can be anything you want. You have to choose the right thing. You can't just be a YouTube star. People's gotta like you. And yeah, I know not a lot of people like me. 200 people out of the entire world like me. And honestly, I love that. At least I have 200 people who like me. And even if they aren't on YouTube, I got people on Facebook who like me. I got people... It doesn't matter. I'm just glad I got people there for me who listen to me on YouTube, which is quite surprising because I always thought it was annoying, but apparently not. We had Cash Me Outside. That was, that, that was something. Honestly, if I could get her included into one of my rap video, into one of my rap songs, that'd be awesome. I mean, I'm 17, she's 15. I think me and her could do a rap album and expose the real horrors of this world, I guess. <laughs> nah, I'm just kidding. She'd never be up for it. I don't even know her. I just found out about her through Sniper Wolf. Honestly, I just saw it as a girl who showed up and did the Cash Me Outside meme automatically. I didn't know she was on Dr. Phil till Sniper Wolf. Then that video got removed from Sniper Wolf somehow, and I don't even know how. But, anyway. It, it, it's good. It, I admit, it's, it's something, right? It's something you figure out. It's something you stand up for. If you're, if you're under 18, and you're watching this, or you aren't going to be 18, say, if... I'm going to say if you're 17 or under and you're watching this, life's tough. It doesn't mean you go get high or take drugs. It doesn't mean you cut, but you can see I haven't. <laughs> life's going to be tough when you're a kid and teenagers, they have all these easy ways to access these items. And I, I'm talking to you guys. You don't. You stand up. Make sure you have somebody behind you, even when you have nobody. Prove them wrong. That's what people's been saying to me my entire life, and I'm I still don't get it, but I'm starting to. I'm starting to get it. 
Although, it will probably be a few more years before I truly do get it, but who knows. I could get it next week. I could figure it out what they mean by that. But you truly don't figure out what you mean until you know. So, yeah. Anyway, guys. Tell me. What is your favorite part of your childhood if you're well of being under 18 if you're over 18 and if you're under 18 tell me what do you want to do when you grow up if you're over 18 tell me what you're going to do what you did as a kid if you're under 18 tell me what you want to do when you grow up if you're over 18 tell me what you did as a kid that you loved and don't regret I'll see you guys maybe in a week, a day, a month, a year, who knows. Make sure to like, please. Just click that like. I at least want three likes on this video. If you actually like this, uh, thanks. Um check out my other videos I'm not saying subscribe to me in this one I want you to check out my other videos and then subscribe will ya tell me what you think of those because this is honestly a boring video of me just talking explaining myself and I'm gonna be there so I might see you tomorrow I might see you later today who knows all I know is I love you guys. Peace out. Give me a fist bump.